Lotta's hockey pictures. I wonder what her camera captured. Besides, you must have realized by now, Pale. There's no way anyone other than Maya Faye could have done it. What am I supposed to say to Pearls now? Way to go, Detective. About Dr. Gray. The victim wasn't super famous, but people still knew who he was. His face was all over those tabloid shows last year. Yeah, I know. I was looking through some newspapers from last year and... Huh? I could have sworn I had cut an article out, but I guess I must have lost it. Oh, gumshoe, you... Don't be fool. <laughs> Searching through his pockets, and boy, those are big. He has a lot of them. That, co that coat's like... 90% pocket. Hmm, it looked really interesting, too. Hey, do you have a copy, pal? A copy of that article? I think Dr. Gray might have brought a copy to the office when he came by. Alright, so we're gonna have to go to the office. About Maya's trial tomorrow. I've got two pieces of news for you, pal. Two? Yeah, bad news and even worse news. So what did you want to hear first? I don't really care. It doesn't change the fact that I'm not going to like it. All right, pal. Well, the prosecutor for or the trial is Prosecutor Von Kama. Dun, dun, dun! Wait, rising from the dead? Zombie pro zombie lawyers? That'd be the greatest game ever! What? Von Karma? <laughs> Manfred Von Karma. He was an awe-inspiring veteran prosecutor. Known for humping walls. Yes. He never lost a case in his 40 years of his career, and he raised a fearsome disciple. The horrible aftertaste of the evil belief he force-fed me is something I'll never forget. He's like Bowser, except even more of a douchebag. Wait a sec. But didn't Von Karma stand trial? And that's where the other piece of bad news comes in. The Von Karma you face tomorrow is actually his successor. Successor? So, um, who is the successor to Von Karma? Literally, pal, it's Prosecutor Von Karma's kid. His kid became a prosecutor real young, like 13. Hasn't lost a trial since. Okay, that raises the question, what woman would be would be crazy or drugged enough to sleep with Von Karma? I don't know. I can't, like... No, he has no appeal to anybody. Anyway. That's what they call a prodigy, pal. No fucking shit. Hmm, kid, huh? Wait a sec. Thirteen? The kid became a prosecutor at the age of thirteen? She's eighteen now. Yep. Alright. <laughs> oh. Yeah, his kid has like a whole bunch of fanboys. I mean, a prodigy like that, I would have heard something about. Oh, no, no, no. The kid was born and raised in Germany, pal. The dead country's got a lot of stuff, and it's a great place to develop a person's talents. Go, Germany. Germany, huh? That's probably why I've never heard of this person. Ugh, still, all it takes is someone mentioning the name Von Karma. And I get terrible flashbacks to that case. Which case? It's that case. Case four yeah. of Phoenix Wright one. Yeah, that which will be all Jay Bizzo. You don't have to deal with me at all. So it's like, he's going to get a million views, I'm going to get one. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, like, Martin Karma traumatized him pretty badly. Almost as much as war traumatizes people. Oh, yeah. He's a douche. Or was a douche. 
Flash, flash. Oh my god, Edgeworth! Stop it, get Stop over. it, get over it, Phoenix. That person is already gone. Who is he referring to? Dun dun dun! Alright, let's see. Tick tick. My company law offices. Ugh, it feels like I've been gone forever. But it's only been one day. Oh, that's right. Where's that newspaper Gray, uh, Dr. Gray brought the other day? Ah, here it is, right on top of my desk. <laughs> Obvious. This is the only thing he left behind that's going to be of any help. And it gets added. All right. No, I didn't. Damn it. All right, now that that one piece of evidence is taken, we can fast travel back to Karain Village. And we can finally break that psych lock. Okay, we've seen this. So I've read this, blah, blah, blah. Damn it. Your proof. Wait, what is that? Ouch, I guess it doesn't have anything to do with it, huh? Crap, it's the wrong evidence. Rose did warn me, if you make a mistake, it will hurt you, she said. If I don't have enough evidence, I should probably say stop. I should probably stop. I should take another look at the court record and think it through one more time. Well, it may be, well, it may be, blah, 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 blah. So anyway. Yep, looks like I didn't have, uh... Damn it. I didn't have, uh... The right evidence. Thankfully, you do heal, uh... After each successful Cyclock. All right, so we're back here. No, I didn't want that. There we go. Um, Dr. Gray brought this over to my office the other day, and... Hey, it's that new story! The one about the malpractice suit! Fourteen patients died, be uh, died and it caused a huge stink. Yeah, but that's not all, pal. Things only got worse after that. You mean the car accident the nurse died in? Hmm. Oh, here we go. I brought my own clipping with me today. Here, pal, this is for you. All right, thanks. And that gets added. All right, that's... That's the evidence we need. That's what we need. So it's the chain, yeah. Shut up, this game gets like confusing. Alright. So present this. We got it this time. Skip all the dialogue we've seen. Repeatedly tapping that button. Take a look at this newspaper clipping. Like, what is it? A story about an accident? Please read the victim's name. Um, Mimi Miney? Miney is a pretty rare last name, wouldn't you say? My last name's pretty common, especially in, uh, Iowa. Miss Mimi Miney wouldn't happen to be a relative of yours, would she? <laughs> So you noticed, she, she was my older sister. I'm sorry about your loss. Your sister, was she a nurse? Perhaps at Dr. Gray's surgical clinic? Gray's surgical clinic. I don't think I need to tell you that clinic was run by the victim, Dr. Turner Gray. Which is how you knew of Dr. Gray. You knew him through your sister. His name is a pun, Turning Gray. You just got that. Turn to the her. And the cyclock breaks. 
Oh, the chains go away. Thank God. Cyclocks become like Retardus Health. Yep, you heal at the end of each successful Cycloc. Which hopefully I won't be totally retarded when I do this. Please, tell me all you know about Dr. Gray. Hi, my sister's name was Mimi Miney. She was like a nurse at Dr. Gray's clinic. That's what I thought. I heard that, like, Dr. Gray was really tough on people, like, a total slave driver. My sis was, like, always coming home totally wiped out because she was overworked. Wiped out. So was that why she fell asleep at the wheel? That, that guy, like, drove my sis so hard, so, like, that's why the accident happened. One where 14 patients died from malpractice? Yeah, like, I think that was the doctor's fault, too. My sis was pushed by, like, everyone's expectations and, like, her duties and stuff. And that pushed her to her death? Oh, I'm sorry. So, like... Are we done? I've like already told my story to like everyone. Do you understand now, Mr. Nick? This is how a psych lock works. Oh, I don't plan to pry into people's hearts unless I absolutely need to. And we were going to be absolutely needing to a lot. God, he gets really retarded. The lock this time was pretty easy, but... You might meet people who aren't as willing to give in later on. If you don't have enough proof, be careful and know when to stop trying. No, the easiest cycloc in this game is one where you get rid of five in one fell swoop. It is awesome. Alright. 